Yes, I am now 81 fishing, so one more level to go, and then I can go ahead and get myself some anglerfish. Oh man, that's such a big upgrade. So besides anglerfish, I'm also looking to get at least 65 herbler, which is in the works right now. I'm farming uh, every now and then. And basically, once I have 65, I can use Green Man's Ale to boost uh, basically infinitely because the ales are easy to buy. And yeah, just make super defense. That's gonna make Zora even better. Oops, just got 64 herb blower from uh, cleaning my herbs. But yeah, I'm slowly working towards that 65 grind. Here we got a. Uh... Actually, what? Dude, I can make super defense in like less than an hour. 40k? That means I can just like finish making uh, some super strengths with this launch, and I should have enough for 65, and then I can, yeah, boost. That's gonna be nice. And that's it. 65 Herbler. Secondary wise from Caress, I got so much, you know, look at this. A thousand plus Limbo Roots. Um, I think we got a lot of White Bears too, a thousand plus. So that's a lot of XP, and ah, uh, Newts are easy to get, so I wanna someday get to at least only one for the range pods. I think it'll be doable, you know, with combination with Kingdom. I think I can get to 71 uh, in time, maybe to use Resolver or something too. That'll be nice. But yeah, that's like a long term plan though. Alright, that is the last of my Condentines for now. I can still make 700 plus more, which is a good thing. So yeah, I'm gonna decamp this. Should get around 204 doses. This is gonna be uh, last me a long time. Really gonna help me as lower, for real. So I just uh, devised a really nice way to get anti poisons. Uh, simply, I set my house to Brimhaven, you know, and obviously I, I put it out so that I teleport outside. The store is right there, super close, so it only takes me a few seconds to get to the store. And yeah, once I, you know, stock up from the store, I just use Karandra Gloves, and then the bank is right there. I just keep repeating, it's super fast. I'll, like, have hundreds of, you know, anti-poisons within, you know, just a few minutes. One more hit. Alright, that should get it. Alright, first solo kill of the day. What we get? Oh, my first dragon halberd. Mmm. Mmm, juicy. Alex right there, 150k. And that's it. Another kill. Okay, so uh, now I am at 60 kills now. Pretty much uh, did exactly, you know, the amount I did yesterday. But uh, I'm gonna try to do a bit more. I'm pretty damn addicted to Zora, so can't really help it. <laughs> 82 fishing, guys. And now I can catch anglerfish in Piscularius district. The best of the best for me, guys. Of all the delicacies, you know, in this game, is the anglerfish. So I would be, you know, fishing right now, but I do need to get a hundred percent Piscularius favor. And fortunately for me, um, they made the hunting grub part a lot easier now. So it was a uh, thirty percent to 100% just doing grubs because that was the fastest but they made it faster now oh man this is going so well the crane used to be so eight but if you uh, are doing the cranes with like um, two to three other people it actually goes by really fast so yeah I, I will get to 50% uh, relatively quick finally guys I have a uh, fucking serious 29.9% come on that was supposed to be 30% Anyways, I'm basically done getting the uh, the first 30% so slow, but can't wait to try out this uh, sandworms from from now on, so Okay, let's just see if this is the last inventory. Here we go Wow, 99.7, but basically I'm done. I timed it all and surprisingly I thought it would take me an hour to get from uh, 30 to 100% but it only took me 32 minutes Yeah 32 minutes, man. That's insanely fast. So much faster than the last time. So, uh, overall, getting from 1 to 100 took me less than 3 hours from scratch. Getting the planks and everything. So, let's go ahead and lock the Piscalarius right there. Okay, I can start uh, doing Anglerfish uh, starting tonight. Now, I still need to, you know, train my cooking to uh, 84. Two more to go. I have plenty of fish for that, so... Woo, that was scary, man. Too many close calls, man. Oh, into the crystal seed. Oh, man, that shit's so rare. Well, 
I've done it now, guys. I guess I can stop killing Zora now because I've gotten uh, the best item in, in this whole game. Look at the Zora skills, though. 18,000. 19,000, actually. Wow. The bank's looking good because of that. Anyways, I'm just going to keep going and, yeah, try to get a drop tonight. Oh, shit. <gasps> Oh my god. Fuck me, guys. That just happened. Wow. I did not see that coming at all. I did not see that coming at all. Oh my god. Shit. Rest in peace. Fuck, guys. Oh man, it was such a tough night to, uh, you know, try to sleep through, bro. Oh man, well, a lot of emotions, you know, started uh, emerging from <laughs> from out of nowhere, you know, after that death, and um, more than just, you know, being really pissed off, I, I was just more sad than anything else, but anyways, I guess um, I'll try to explain kind of how that happened. Um, essentially, I definitely got caught off guard. Uh, definitely distracted but what happened is I don't know actually I just kind of like zoned out yeah like I normally instinctively would have my prayers on you know after the next phase but I guess it was a long day and yeah I just couldn't uh, focus enough you know I just lost my focus and right as soon as like you know my brain started processing that I was getting hit my brain was still too, you know what I mean? It was like not uh, just working. <laughs> it was so slow for, to me. Like I, I just couldn't press my buttons. I don't know, man. I basically zoned out at the worst time possible. So yeah, dude. Anyways, I did manage to get, you know, up to 93 kills, which was, I mean, it, it's still an awesome achievement, but I am just really disappointed that, you know, I had to uh, die at this point. You know, I was getting close to maybe an item maybe you know so yeah I'm just gonna do this all in one take yo man it fucking sucks dude but anyways this is um how this account was meant to be played you know with one life so now that you know that one life is over so is the hardcore Iron Man series well it'll probably take a little bit of time for me to like you know fully uh get over it you know I, I still get like that you know tight feeling in my heart just thinking about it just editing this video was fucking painful bro like once I got to the part where you know I see my character die I'm just like oh fuck me man that didn't have to happen I really wish that didn't happen you know but it fucking did so and I did say in the beginning that it was gonna be a mini series because I honestly honestly thought I wouldn't really get too far in the hardcore just because I DC and anytime can happen like that I die but um, yeah actually this time it was just my own uh, fault personally you know so many things I could have done to have prevented it maybe I could have focused a bit more maybe I could have just you know stopped killing Zora I like went too hard that day you know maybe I should just take in a rest and do it another day whatever so many uh, things that you know you could say that, oh, I could have done differently, but yeah, that's the reality. So, anyways, I really did enjoy my time working on this character, you know, I'm, I really, really want to keep playing and, like, do Zora, but, you know, not as a normal Iron Man. So, guys, this will be the last you will see of this character, probably indefinitely, for a long time. I have no plans to, you know, uh, return to this character, but, of course... All the stats that I've achieved, you know, all the quests that I've done on this character, favor, everything, you know, every little accomplishment, and all of my PVM accomplishments, everything will stay here on this character, never to be forgotten, because it was such a genuine experience, you know. How does one play on an account fearing for his life? Like, when has that been a thing on RuneScape ever since years back? This character really brought it back, and in the span of these few months that I worked on this character, I have seriously accomplished so many things on here, man. Just didn't get that Zoro item, but you know, in terms of 
Everything else, Slayer wise, I've got all the stuff that I really wanted. Uh, barrels wise, same. You know, we also got all the other uh, melee stuff that people have dreamed of, you know? So, the bank value, 131 mil, which is pretty impressive. Zora definitely beefed it up quite a bit. But, here's a quick uh, look through of all the items, guys. But yeah, man. Such a good grind. So before the video ends, there will be a short recap of everything that has happened thus far from beginning to end. All the important stuff that you know I can think of on the top of my head. So before I end the video, thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope to see you guys soon with another video in a few days. So look forward to that, alright? Take care.